The function of the lungs is to extract oxygen from the atmosphere and transfer it into the bloodstream, and reciprocally to release carbon dioxide from the bloodstream into the atmosphere. In humans, each lung is made of three lobes. Each have between two and five bronchopulmonary segments. The primary bronchi enter each lung at the helum, a central recession at the root of the lung. The primary bronchi branch into lobar bronchi, which in turn branch into tertiary, or segmental bronchi. Each bronchopulmonary segment has its own segmental bronchi and arterial supply, making each segment a discrete unit. The lungs are part of the lower respiratory tract and accommodate the bronchial airways when they branch from the trachea. The lungs include the bronchial airways that terminate in the alveoli, the lung tissue in between, and veins, arteries, nerves, and lymphatic vessels. The trachea and bronchi have plexuses of lymph capillaries in their mucosa and submucosa. The smaller bronchi have a single layer, and they are absent in the alveoli. All of the lower respiratory tract, including the trachea, bronchi, and bronchioles, is lined with respiratory epithelium. This is a ciliated epithelium interspersed with goblet cells which produce mucus and club cells with actions similar to macrophages. Incomplete rings of cartilage in the trachea and smaller plates of cartilage in the bronchi keep these airways open. Bronchioles are too narrow to support cartilage and their walls are made of smooth muscle, and this is largely absent in the narrow respiratory bronchioles, which are mainly just of epithelium. The respiratory tract ends in lobules. Each lobule consists of a respiratory bronchiole, which branches into alveolar ducts and alveolar sacs, which in turn divide into alveoli.